cool. Megan was much more agreeable to be around. She had just sort of become this different person, um, one that I was liking very much and hoping to even get to know a lot better. Well, I brought you out here because I wanted to share something with you to give you something from home. I would very much like to stay out here while you read it, but if you'd like some privacy, I'd be happy to step aside and let you read it on your own. Um, well, I guess you could stay out here. Okay, that's great. This is a lot. My letter would not be filled with apologies and empty promises, that's for sure. It is time for you to step back and take a good look at your life. It is time for you to step back and take a good look at your life. Your behavior is not only disrespectful, it is downright embarrassing. And I really don't appreciate being treated like a doormat. I am not your personal slave. I have kissed every band-aid and nursed every wound with all my heart. Your behavior makes my life a living hell. I feel like this is the first time I can say what I feel without you screaming at me. I hope this experience helps you understand the real meaning of respect and responsibility. And someday we can have a conversation with our inside voices and really hear what each other is saying. I believe in you. Love you more, Mommy. Do you agree with all those things, all those points she made? You do? Yeah. Can you tell me what you think upsets you the most about the letter? All of it. All of it. She just knows that you have a lot more potential and it may be breaking her heart, you know, when she sees you making other choices. You know, when you're young, you can make more mistakes and it's easier to correct them, but the older you get, it's harder to stop and turn around and, and go down a different path. You don't get do-overs, at least not very often. What do you think in there would be the hardest thing to change about your behavior? Mm, being disrespectful. Do you think that's something that you would be willing to work on a little bit when you got home? Mm -hmm. Well, that's great. I'm glad to hear that. I think that letter really hit home with her. You know, but sometimes habits are hard to break, so sometimes it might take a little bit of time. Can I have a hug? Thank you. I think you're beautiful. I think you're a lovely child. And you're going to be such a lovely, wonderful person. When you grow up. <laughs> it makes me feel really bad that I make her life a living hell. I realize that things need to change at home. Can we stop? I hope Megan learned responsibility and respect. Those are the two things I want her to get out of this experience. I was nervous to see my mom. Hi, Mommy. Hey, kiddo. Miss me? How are you? Good. I miss you. You do? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Wanna go inside? Yeah. I was nervous that she may have embarrassed me with her behavior. We were just curious to hear in your words why you felt like it was important for her to come and spend the time with us. Megan's pretty unruly and does what she wants and when she wants, regardless of what you tell her. Megan thinks she's always right. Um, she'll just browbeat you and argue and argue and stand off, trying to get you to change your mind. So um, my goal for Megan was hoping that she could learn some respect and some responsibility by spending time with another family. 
her attitude was extremely, extremely um, disrespectful, mm -hmm. defiant. And I talked to her a little bit about you. I would try to say, how, how does your mom feel when you treat her like this? Don't you think it hurts her in her heart to know that you don't treat her with respect? What we learned with Megan is we've got to be more stubborn. But the best thing out of this would be is where your relationship goes from here. Mm -hmm. Gonna be less disrespectful and help around the house and keep my room clean and go to school on time. That would be a big bonus. The price of greatness is responsibility, remember that. Mm -hmm. I'm excited to come home and start over. Love you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We saw a big change in her. I was so happy, I was so delighted, and the more I knew her, the more I wanted to know her. Thank you. It was our pleasure. It Thank really you. It really was our pleasure. We did hit on um, a lot of the, the issues and problems that Megan has with her mom. Such a pleasure. You too. I think they're gonna leave here um, giving a better effort to their relationship. Goodbye. I'm very grateful. Um, they seem like a great, wonderful family. I just hope that she takes everything she's learned here and applies it to her life and all aspects of her life. Are you here, Fina? Be good. When I first got here, I was rude and disrespectful. And now that I'm leaving, I have learned how to have respect for people. Love you. I love you too. Love you more.